Right guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make this hyper realistic lettuce cake. So first of all I took two 8 inch cakes, I used a half sphere tin for the top one and I rounded the bottom one into a half sphere. Obviously you can use two half sphere tins um, or you can use just 8 inch rounds and carve them into half spheres but the basic shape you want is a whole sphere. Once that's all done and you've layered the cake up, I've used buttercream for this and then chocolate ganache on the outside, you want to then get some sugar paste. You don't have to cover the whole thing in sugar paste because we're going to make the individual leaves and attach them like that. So I'm just rolling out equal amounts of the sugar paste to make my different lettuce leaves. So I'm just going to roll the sugar paste out as thin as I can and then start to vein it using my fingers and also my Dresden tool afterwards. But you want it really crinkled towards the edges, really thin towards the edges and then really textured. So I'm using some crunched up cling film to texture and again when it's on I'll use my Dresden tool. So I'm draping my first leaf over, this is going to be the one that's at the front. So I want to spend the most time with this. I'm just using the one end of my Dresden tool to add vein effects to the lettuce leaf. Once I'm happy with the amount of detail I have on that one, I'm going to move on to the next one and do the exact same thing. I'm just going to build up these leaves. You can add as many as you want depending on what sort of lettuce you want to go for. But you want an overlap on the left and the right basically. Now to the airbrushing. I'm airbrushing with Spectrum Flow Lemon Yellow mixed with some Party Green and it makes this lime green colour. But you can use the Spectrum Flow Lime Green. So you want to just go in darker, which therefore means closer, where the leaves meet on the sides. And then I'm basically airbrushing all over because what I'm going to do is add some water to my cup, airbrush that on, and as you can see, I can remove the colour then using a paper towel. I'm also using this brush just to brush away the colour where I've sprayed the water. And this just leaves colour right in the veins and gives a real cool lettuce like effect. Finishing it off by airbrushing the end of the lettuce just with some Spectrum Flow chocolate brown with some yellow still mixed in the cup to give it a sort of orangey colour. And that's it guys. That's how you make this hyper realistic lettuce cake.